Hey guys, welcome to another McLaren Brothers unboxing video. This is the August Collector's Core from Marvel. This is for Secret Wars, and this box is really cool. It's got the Lady Thor on the front. I know a lot of people whined whenever Lady Thor came out, but I don't mind her. I mean, I agree with the certain people that said, we don't care that the character of Thor is now a woman, but why can't she just have a different name and be her own character? Why does her name have to be Thor too? And I kind of agree with that. Like, it seems like they could have just kept Thor and had her be Thor's cousin or Thor's, I don't know, distant relative and give her her own personality and her own backstory and her own identity and everything completely unique to her. I do agree with that, but I like her overall. But yeah, anyway, that's beside the point. All right, so the first thing we have is the pin and the patch that we get every time. This, this collector core pin, I can't tell if that's supposed to be War Machine because it's gray or if it's just an Iron Man that's gray, but it's one of the two characters. And then the other is based on the, the look of the patch. I'm gonna guess that this is Falcon as Captain America. I haven't kept up on Secret War, so maybe you know the answers and I don't. So the first thing we have right off the top is the shirt and it is for Secret Wars. I'm gonna go ahead and tear it open because I'm gonna keep the shirt. It's a Secret Wars shirt and it looks like they're stylized as the Funko characters. So you have Thor, Spider-Man, and Captain America, Falcon, and I still don't know if this is Iron Man or War Machine but it's one of those two. This is really cool. I like this a lot. Like I said, I haven't kept up on Secret Wars as much as I need to. I've been really slacking. I've just been super busy at work, so I haven't even had time to start reading anything leading up to, let alone Secret Wars. But yeah, I really like this shirt. The next thing we have is a bagged and boarded number one of Secret Wars with the Collector Core front cover variant with the female Thor on it. This is a really nice cover too. I like this a lot. Unfortunately, I'll never open it. I don't know how collectible it'll be, but I'll never open it just because it is it is a collectible item. I definitely still want to read Secret Wars, so I'll have to either use Marvel Unlimited or just go purchase the individual issues. But I'm really excited for this. This is really cool. And the next thing we have is... Oh, nice. The Secret Wars Miles Morales exclusive pop toy. Uh, Miles Morales is the one of the new Spider-Man. He's not super new anymore. He's been Spider-Man for a little while. This is really a cool pop. I've stopped buying so many of these just because A, they're kind of expensive and B, my shelves are just completely packed with them. But I do get them from these boxes and I always enjoy them. And this one's a really cool one. So I'm really excited to add this one to the collection. The next thing we have is another Funko Pop, and this is for the Secret Wars female Thor, and she's also exclusive to the Marvel Collector Core box. I won't have to go over my spiel about how I have too many of these because you just heard it, but she's really cool. And that looks like that's the end of the box. There is a pretty decent amount of stuff in here. I am 100% satisfied with everything that I got. There's the t-shirt, the two pops, the comic book and then the pen and the patch and i really like all of this stuff this is the third box that they've had and this is the third box that i've got and every box has exclusive items throughout so all of these things are exclusive to this box and i really love everything in this box there's not a single thing that i'm like even so so on anyway thanks for watching make sure you like subscribe comment and share you can also find us on twitter at mclaren bros